Hey everyone, I'm Mercedes Owens and I'm a Barry's X founding instructor and so I'm so excited to lift with you today. We're gonna be doing your Class Fit Sugar 30 minute dumbbell workout. I'm gonna be working with 10 pound weights. So grab your equipment and let's get this thing started. All right y'all, let's get this party started. This is one of my favorite workouts ever. I love to work with these dumbbells. So we're gonna warm you up for three minutes, get your body good and ready before we pick them up. Just find some space. We'll start with some big deep breaths in, exhales out, hands overhead. Let's go in three, two, and one. On your clock is on. Big deep breath in, big exhale out right here, bringing your hands down, making sure you got plenty of space in front of you because we are gonna walk it out from here. You've got five. Give me a big deep breath in, exhale out in three, two, one more right here. Hands come down and we walk it all the way out into your plank position. Keeping your legs as straight as possible. We'll walk it all the way back up right there. All right, another big deep breath in, walk it out, exhale out. Good, we're gonna take this down into your plank. Let's go for one more walkout. We'll take it down into your plank and we'll hold there in three, two, and one. Walk it out, hold that plank. We're gonna stretch this out with a runner's lunge. Right foot forwards, then bring it back. We definitely wanna work through your entire body through this warm up right here, all right? Right foot forwards, let it feel good. Take it back, you got eight. We're gonna add in a push up in five, four, Three, two, and one. Give me one push up. Taking your left foot forwards, bring it back. One push up. Now with these push ups, you can always do them from your knees if you need to. It looks just like this. Knees down, drop in the chest. Exhale, press it up, and then you're back into that stretch right there, okay? Just make sure your chest is dropping down first. We don't want our hips touching the ground first. That's not a push-up, that's you doing the worm, okay? We're gonna take out your lunge. It is just your push-up in five seconds. Stay with me, you got four, three, two, and one right here from your toes or from your knees. Drop in the chest, exhale, press it up. You want your elbows at 45 degrees right there. Drop the chest, exhale, press it up. Nice, y'all. Drop the chest, exhale, press it up. Good, from here, we're gonna take you right into some up downs. Feet jump forwards, we stand it up, we take it back down in three, two, and one. Feet come forwards, let's stand it up, take it back down. Notice how I'm lifting my chest before I do anything else right there. Good job, almost done with this warm up. You will get a 30 second shake out before we grab our weights. So work through it with me right here, stand it up. Take it down, nice. We're gonna stand this up, drop the booty down and hold your squat nice and low in five, four, three, two, one. Right here, stand it up, then make your way down into that low squat hold. Letting it burn, we feel that tension building up and we like it, we like move into it. Don't stray away from it, you wanna stay in it. You got five, you got four, you got three, two, there's one, stand it up, shake it out. All right, y'all, water towel, do what you need to do. We're about to get this lift started. You're gonna start with both dumbbells. We're going biceps first. So here's how it's gonna work. We're working sections and blocks, okay? So once we get through one block, you'll always get a 30 second recovery, a chance to bring that heart rate back down. We'll grab your weights, we'll go into the next block, all right? Let's find them here. We're starting with your bicep curls and we're gonna alternate first. Shoulders down and back. Stop bending the knees, one right, one left. Let's alternate this bicep curl. Good, all the way to the top, squeezing there. Then you lower down, you also wanna flex at the bottom so you get your triceps once they're down there, okay? Working all the way through your movement. Every single bit of it counts, so we don't wanna waste any of it. 10 seconds, we're going both arms at the same time. You've got five, you've got four, you've got three, two, that's your one, both arms at the same time. Big squeeze, lower down, 30 seconds right here. Then we're gonna introduce your lower body with these weights, all right? Now, as we do our reps, I want you to know I'm always looking for quality over quantity. So if you need a second to reset, go for it. What we don't want is to start throwing our elbows, throwing our arms, we wanna stay locked in. You got that soft bend in your knees? Perfect, we're gonna widen up that stance. We're adding in a squat at the top of that curl in five, four, three, two, one. Give me a big curl at the top. You're dropping it down for your squat right there. Another curl, bring it up, drop it down. There's your squat. Yes, y'all, we want one of each. Dropping that booty nice and low, squeezing the glutes at the top right there. 15 seconds. Come on, we're gonna take out your curl. It'll just be your squat. You've got 10. We'll leave that weight on your shoulders. You can relax the grip by resting the weights on your shoulders in three, you got two, you've got one. Take those weights up, relax them onto your shoulders. 
Good. Now we're going to push all that weight into our heels. Drive the hips back. Sit into your squat right there. Let's get some good strong reps in. Come on. Drop it down. Bring it up. Squeeze the glutes at the top, y'all. Drop it down. Bring it up. Big squeeze. Come on. Exhale as you stand it up. Where your movement is the most difficult, that's where you want your exhale because you want your breath to help you out, right? Good job. We're dropping down to one weight only. We're really gonna heat things up here in five, four, three, two, and one. Let go of one weight. Now we're doing a dumbbell swing to a squat swing, okay? Weights in between, diamond grip it, interlace those fingers, holding on tight. Give me a dumbbell swing, and then your squat swing right there. One of each, dumbbell swing, squat swing. Get those heart rates up. Burn out those legs. Come on. Dumbbell swing, squat swing. Yes, y'all, you got this. Woo. Dumbbell swing, squat swing. Drop those booties. One of each. Come on. You got 10. You got nine. You got eight. There's seven in six. Five, four, three, two. That's one weight down. We're gonna take this down to the ground. You're going cross body climber right away. Let's move down to the ground, hands and toes. Take your knee across the body. There's that cross body climber. You feel those obliques lining up. Whew. Push through, push through, push through. Good, we're getting to your recovery in three, in two, in one. Here's your recovery. Drop those knees, breathe it out. Shake it out, there's your first set, okay? The next one, we're gonna start on our feet. You're going shoulder press. So find your weight, roll those shoulders back. All right, we're gonna alternate your shoulder press to start this off. If you need to switch your stance, maybe a split stance, legs out wide, whatever feels right for you, let's get into it. You're on in three, two, one. We're alternating your shoulder press. One right, one left. If you need the little kip in the knees, Bring it into play. Let those legs help you out. Press it up, one right, one left. Good, when you need to rest, bring your hands all the way down. A little shimmy, we love a shimmy. A little shimmy if you need it. And then take it back up. What we don't want is to rest right here, you know? We don't wanna form bad habits. Elbows are up, they're out. We're active through it, all right? We're going both arms at the same time in three, two, and one, both arms up. Take it back down. Make sure those hands get to the top. Good, you should feel your chin poke forward just a little when your hands get up to the top. That's how you know you reach full extension. It's up, good, lower back down, 15 seconds. It's up, yes, keep pressing it up. Come on, you got 10. Use those abs, use those legs to help you. You've got eight. We're dropping down to one weight in five, four, three, two, one. Let's put one weight down. You're gonna hold this right here on either end. Okay, single weight. Let's start with just the press. Then we're gonna add in a little jumping jack, okay? When the hands go up, the legs go out. In three, two, one, let's go. Hands up, good. Hands up, yes. See how my legs are jumping out at the same time? Once you got it, start to pick it up right here. Let's go, hits up, back down. Yes, it's up, back down. You've got 10, that's it. There's nine, eight in it, eight, in seven, in six, in five, four, three, two, one, hold that weight at your chest. Let's go lower body, alternating your lateral lunge. One right, one left. Dropping it down, get into that booty. Come on, you gotta keep your chest lifted. Important note right here, make sure your knee and your toe are facing same direction. So, so, so important. Let's make sure that's happening right there. You've got five. We're gonna keep our feet planted in four, three, two, one. Give me a nice wide stance, drop it low. Now we're gonna shuffle side to side. Those feet are planted, we're not moving. Our feet at all, just taking it side to side, letting it work, letting it burn, good. Come on, y'all. There we go, there we go, there we go. You got 10. We're gonna add a couple pulses on either side. In five, in four, in three, in two, in one, drop it down, pulse one, pulse two, drop it down, pulse one, pulse two, there we go, pulse one, pulse two, yes, pulse one, pulse two. Now get ready, take those pulses out. We're gonna move with a sense of urgency, right to left without your pulse, in five. You got four, you got three, you got two, you got one, right to left without that pulse. Go quick, 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 heart rate's up. 10 seconds right here, come on. There we go, you got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, 
two, and that's your one. Stand it up, shake it out, let's get rid of your weight. We're taking it down to the ground. You're going Spider-Man climbers, which means your right knee, right shoulder. Left knee, left shoulder, taking it to the outside, all right? In three, two, and one, let's go. Working the outside of that body, right there, go out, then back. Go out, then back. Now the goal here as you do this, See how parallel to the ground you can get that inner thigh, okay? Open up, pull it in, take it back. Yes, y'all, you got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, that's one. Drop the knees, rest. Okay, I figured now would be a good time to lay down after all that work. So when we pick this back up and get back into our next block, it's a chest press, all right? 10 seconds, grab your weights. We're gonna lay this back, hands up in three, two, and one, hands up. Alternate your chest press, one right, one left. Exhale as you press it up, all right? You want your elbows dropping down to 45 degrees. If they're straight out, you're relying on those shoulders a little too much. We gotta protect our shoulders, so tuck the elbows in just a little bit, good. 10 seconds, you're going both arms at the same time, all right? Both arms at the same time. In five, four, three, two, one. Give me some good strong reps. Lower down, exhale, press it up. Lower down, exhale, press it up, right there. Get all the way to the top. Working that power output with a good strong press. Come on, drop it down, press it up. Yes, y'all, you got this. 15 seconds, you're gonna smash those weights together and we're really gonna go for reps right here, okay? 12 seconds, we're gonna smash them together. Come on, you got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, right here, smash them, let's go. Quick reps, down, back up, down, back up. Yes, burning it out, burning it out, burning it out, come on. Whew. Right there, take it down, press it up, take it down, press it up. Nice, y'all, 20 seconds, that's it. Pushing through it, right? We like the burn, that's how we know it's working, right there, if it's burning, it's what? It's working, you got 12 seconds, that's it. Stay with me, here's 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, that's one. Take these weights to your thighs, Sit it up, we're gonna flip this over, and we're gonna work some push-ups, okay? This is where you're gonna get a little upset with me. Bear with me, it's gonna make you stronger. Flip it over, here's what we got. Every three push-ups, you're holding for three counts, right above the ground, from your knees or from your toes, up to you. Let's go in three, two, and one right here. Every three, we hold for three, two, one, press it up. Every three, you hold for three, two, one, Press it up. Use that breath to help you, y'all. Stay in it. You got this, you got this, you got this. We're taking out your hold. You're moving quick in three, in two, in one. No more hold, just up, back down, up, back down. Right there, yes, keep looking down at the ground. You don't wanna lift that chin. Look down right there, abs are tight. We're gonna drop this, you're gonna hold it for eight counts in three, two, one. Drop it, hold it, eight, seven, six. There's five, you got it, four, and three, in two, one, press it up. Rest, little child's pose if you want it. Big deep breath in, exhale out. Whew. Okay, that's our chest set. We got triceps up next, and we're gonna stay down here on our knees, okay? We'll be kneeling. This is gonna get you a lot of good core work in with your tricep work, okay? We are starting with both weights, and we'll drop down to one, hang in there, here we go. Grabbing your weights, we're gonna smash them together, Take your hands up, overhead, overhead tricep extension. Let's go, lower down, bring it up just like that. Lower down, good, bring it up, squeeze at the top. Feel the back of your arms working, burning. You're hugging your face with your biceps. Your elbows are pointed forwards. Yes, the back of your arm should be facing me. Come on, lower down. Bring it up, good. In 10 seconds, you're gonna let go one way, one way only. Hang on to it for another six. Here's five, here's four, three, two, that's one. Get rid of one weight. Diamond grip the other. This is where we have some fun. You're gonna give me two kneeling tricep extensions. Lock those arms out, step it up to your feet. Two on your feet right there. Other foot brings you down. Good, two reps right there. Lock out. Walk it up, two reps at the top. There we go, arms stay bent, 
bring it down, good. So on the way to the top, your arms are straight. On the way to the bottom, arms are bent. Yes, working hard or hardly working. You got 10, so we're on our feet. It's just those reps in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. If you need to rest, shake it out. Bring that weight down. A little shimmy. I told you we love a shimmy. Then bring it back up. Just that overhead tricep extension. Down, back up. Good. This is where you want to get some reps. We're trying to make that weight disappear behind your head right there. Come on. 10 seconds. That is it. There's nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, that's your one. Weights go down. We're not done yet with your tricep work. We're dropping it down for your push-ups. Every three, you pulse for three. This time, elbows glued by your side for the tricep push-up. In three, two, one, let's go. Drop the chest, three, two, one. Pulse three, two, one. Press it up. As you press up, try to move the ground forwards. That's really gonna target your triceps. You're like, no Mercedes, I can't. I'm gonna fall on my face. It wouldn't be the first time, okay? If you think I've never fallen on my face with a tricep push up, then we never met. Don't be afraid to fall on your face. All you do is get up and try again. Come on, that's as bad as it gets. Let's go. You're taking out that pulse in three, two, one. Wrap it down, back up. Keep those elbows in close to your body. You gotta glue them there, y'all. Abs are tight. Everything is working. We've got this. We're lowering down. We're holding eight counts in three, two, one. Hold it, eight. Now pulse is seven. There's six, in five, in four, in three, in two. That's one. Press it up. Child's pose if you want it. Whew. Another block bites the dust. We got this, y'all. Shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Okay, we're gonna go with our back. Keep working that posterior chain, and then we'll be on our feet, and I promise I won't make you do another push-up yet, okay? You'll have a long break from push-ups. Grabbing your weights. We're gonna start from your knees kneeling right here. We're gonna row it up, one right, one left from your knees, okay? You want the elbow to wrap around your body just a little bit. This is like your semi-renegade row right here. Go right, lower down, go left. Letting that elbow wrap around. When you stop it too soon, all you get is your lats. And we're here to work the entire back. So let that elbow wrap, take it down. Make sure the weight's going back towards your pockets. There we go. In 10, you're gonna take this up to toes if you can. If it's not a reality, stay on your knees. That's totally fine. But we're gonna find our plank position if we can. In three, two, one, plank position. Try it. You know, you never know until you do. Come on, maybe today's the day that it works. One right, one left. If you need to do a couple from your knees, a couple from your toes, that's an option there too. Let's go, come on. One right, one left. Those abs are working, everything's tight. You got eight seconds, that's it. We are on our feet in five, four, three, two, one. And jump this up to your feet. Keep that chest down, both arms row. Roll it back to pockets, lower down, yes. Big set right here, it's heavy and we like it. Come on, take it up, back down. When you need to lift the chest, lift the chest. That's gonna happen for sure, but what do we do? We get back into it. We didn't come here to quit, so we're gonna keep on pushing. You got 10 seconds, come on. You got nine seconds, come on. You got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more. Good, put one weight down. All right, here we go. You're gonna hold this weight at your chest. Left leg drops back, you're in a lunge. We're gonna halo the weight in three, two, one, hold your lunge. Now halo the weight up and over. If it's too much with the weight, then ditch it. But I want you to keep that same motion so we can practice working our balance. All this functionality right here. Big halo to the right, big halo to the left. You got five, that's it. Here's four, that's it. Three, two, one, stand it up. Okay, we start it over. Back at the top, down on the ground, hands and knees. 10 seconds to get there. Row right, row left. So you're getting a second shot at this, a second chance. You're gonna let it pass you by, or you're gonna give it everything you got. That's what I thought. We're gonna give it everything we got. In three, two, one. Let's go. One right, one left. Now you know how this set ends right here. So make up your mind. Are you gonna push a little harder? 
do something different, right? Do something that you didn't do on the last set. That's how we make this second chance count, okay? If you never made it up to toes, not once on that first set, let's try it on this one, okay? Up to toes in three, in two, in one. Just try it. You can always go back down to your knees. But if you never try it from your toes, how will you ever know if you can do it? Come on, you got to push the limits right here. Nine, you got eight. We're on our feet in seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. On your feet, both arms row. Take it up, back down. Take it up, back down. Yes, lots of back today. Come on, row it up. Squeeze, lower back down. We got this. We got this. We got this. Come on, 15 seconds. You're down to one weight and one weight only. Again, lift the chest if you need to. Shake it out if you need to. Then get back into your reps for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, that's one. Put one weight down. All right, this time your right leg drops back. Let's find your lunge in three, two, one. Right leg drops back. Find that lunge. Here's your halo up and around, other direction, up and around. Abs are tight, they're working. Come on, up and around. Good, we rest after this. You got 10 seconds, that is it. Keep those halos coming up and around. Crunch, up and around, crunch. Good, here's five, four, three, two, that's one. Stand it up, get rid of that weight, shake it out. Okay, we're gonna lay down. I thought now would be the time for sure to get some abs in, okay? So in 20 seconds, we'll be down on the ground. You're like, no, I'm already there. Rest. Rest, rest. 10 seconds, we're down on the ground. Here's what we got, a weighted sit up. We got an ab series with your weights, then no weights to finish your ab series, and then we got your true finisher at the end. So you can squeeze one between your feet. If you have a hard time anchoring down, squeeze one, hold the other weight at your chest. Let's go with your sit up in three, two, and one. Weighted sit up, all the way up. Squeeze, lower back down, good. Active through it all, come on, all the way up. Lower back down, breathe through it, come on. All the way up, lower back down. Notice how I'm not just letting my chest collapse to the ground. I'm bringing it down one vertebrae at a time, nice and slow, getting those lower abs right there. Good y'all, 15 seconds. We're gonna drop this only halfway back. You're gonna hold it right there. We got five, we drop it halfway back. We're holding there in three, two, here's your one. Drop it halfway back. Hold it, hold it, hold it, good. In 10, we're gonna leave these feet on the ground. We're gonna rush and twist with that weight. Now this weight, we're gonna take away from our body to twist it out. I wanna see your torso really rotate to hit it. In three, two, one, weights away from your body. Rotate that torso, get the weight down to the ground. Rotate right, rotate left. Woo, there it is, come on. We get tired and we start to sit it up as we rotate. When that happens, take a second, draw back. Come on, you don't have to be perfect, but I do need perfect effort right here. 12 seconds, that's it. Right, then left, right, then left. You got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, that's one. Sit it up, get rid of that weight. All right, here we go, all the way up, all the way down. There's no weight, sit up, just capitalizing on your burn and getting your heart rates back up. Throw those arms like a ball slam, throw them, come on. All the way up, all the way down, good, in 10. We drop it halfway back, it's that ISO hold that we saw earlier, this time, no weight. In five, four, three, two, here's your one, drop it back, ISO hold, hold right here. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Now on my cue, we're gonna lower all the way down to the ground. Bicycle crunch, all right? You got five, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Lower those shoulders down, knees up. Bicycle crunch, go right, go left, right, left. You get 30 seconds to recover after this. So push through and earn that recovery. Come on, right to left, left to right. What we're really looking for is full extension of the leg, then pull the knee back in. Don't cut them short. Full extension of the leg, bring it back in. Yes, lower abs, there they are. We got 10 seconds, that's it, come on. Right here, you've got eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, that's one. There we go, rest. Okay, we're making our way up to our feet when you're ready. Take your time. When you're ready, we're on our feet. We're gonna go over this finisher. Here's how we're gonna work. 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off, 
three times through. Once we hit that third set, we are done. We stretch it out. We let those bodies feel good and proud of all the work we've gotten through, okay? But we're not done yet, so stay locked in with me. Stay focused. We're gonna go man makers, putting everything we've seen all together. Row right, row left, big push up. You'll jump it up, there's your curl, squat to press, okay? All of it together, let me say it again. Renegade, row right, row left, big push up from there. You jump it up on your feet, you give me a curl, a squat, we'll press those weights overhead. If at any point the weights are too much, get rid of them, but keep on moving, okay? Here we go, man makers. Here we go, grab those weights. We start on the ground, 30 seconds, all out effort in five, four, three, two, here's your one, row right, row left, drop that chest, there's your push up, jump it up, here's your curl, you got your squat, you got your press right there. Go again, come on, jump it down, row right, row left, push up, curl, squat, press. Y'all, I'm here to tell you that you only got 10 seconds left. 10 seconds, that is it, push through. Here's seven, here's six, here's five, in four, in three, two, that's your one, rest 15. One down, two to go, working hard. Or oh, hardly working, y'all sweating yet? Oh yeah, it's a good time, it's a party. All right, we got your second set right here, same thing y'all, row right, row left, big push up, jump it up, curl, squat, press, round two, let's go in three, two, one, take it down to the ground, here's your row right, row left, big push up, drop that chest, press it up, jump it up, you curl, you squat, you press, there's one down right there, keep them coming, you wanna do this as many times as possible y'all, we're already 15 seconds in, can you get through two more times right here, row right, Row left, big push up, jump it up, curl, squat, press. Here's your final count. You've got eight, follow through. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, rest. Two down, one to go. We're down to the last one. This is it, y'all. Down to the last one. More time, okay? The third, the final. We're gonna make this the best set yet so we can finish stronger than how we started. Here we go. Five, four, three, Two, one, final 30 seconds. You're on the ground, you're in it. You got it and you know it, right? We push past the first two. We push past this last one. We get to the finish line stronger than how we walked in. Come on, go right, Woo. go left. Yes, drop that chest, push up. You know the deal, jump it up. Big curl, big squat, big press. Good, you got 10 seconds, that's it. Can you get through one more set? Finish strong, here's eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, that's one. There we go. Get rid of your weights, get them out of the way. You're like, I don't even wanna look at them at this point. I know the feeling. Get rid of them. Breathe it out, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Let's take that stance out wide and start our stretch. This time when we take our big deep breath in, hands overhead, big exhale out, we'll let them fall in three, two, one. Here it is, big deep breath in, hands up. Big exhale out, hands down. Nice, y'all. Big deep breath in, hands up. Exhale out, hands down. All right, we'll take those hands up. Last one, big deep breath in. Whew. Big exhale out, interlace your fingers, palms towards the ceiling. We're gonna reach it over to the right. We're gonna reach it over to the left. In this stretch, I love to remind us to just thank our bodies, our minds for everything that went down just now, okay? Release those hands, drop them back behind you. Lots to be proud of right here. You wanna pull your hands away from your body, lift the chin, opening up the chest, and we'll drop it down into your forward fold. Still pulling your hands away from your body. Now release all the tension in your neck and let your head hang heavy. Then release your grip. Let's grab onto opposite elbow and just ragdoll. Swing it side to side. Drop the hands, walk it over to the right foot. Let's drop it into your runner's lunge. Straighten back out, walk the hands over to the left. Other side, drop into your left side runner's lunge. Straighten out and back to the center. Letting your head hang nice and heavy. We're gonna drop the hips here, using those elbows for a big yoga squat, opening up the hips. If it feels good, you can sway side to side. If not, don't force it. Then stop in the center, hands down, soft bend in the knees. Walk both hands over to the right. Drop down into your runner's lunge. 
straighten out the leg. Walk both hands over to the left. Drop down into your runner's lunge. Keep taking those big deep breaths in. Exhales out, straighten out the leg, back to the center. Now this time we're gonna drop the hips down into your yoga squat, using those elbows to help you open up the hips. Good job, it feels good. Sway side to side, but don't force it. Only if it feels good, if it feels right. And then we'll stop it in the center, hands down, hips up. Again, letting your head just hang heavy. Right here, we'll take a soft bend in the knees. Roll it up super slowly. Your head is the last to lift. And at the top, big deep breath in, big exhale out, hands go up. Bring your palms together for me. We're taking all of this strength, all of this energy with us into the rest of our day. Show yourself some love, y'all. And that's all I've got for you, y'all. Thank you so much for working out with me. I'm Mercedes Owens. This was your Class Fit Sugar workout, and I'll see you on the next one.